What's good, you guys? It's your girl, Cutie, and I'm back with another video. Jaden, listen, why are your interviews always talking about Krishan? okay? Tell us about your business plans. Tell us about your future success. Tell us what you want to do. Tell us what your dreams are, because you and Krishan have to be careful with who y'all laying down with, okay? Y'all know Blue doesn't care, in my opinion. And Jaden, you have to realize that Blue, uh, Blue deceived you, okay? Krishan was wrong for messing with your man, bottom line. But you keep bringing up, she did it to me, she laughed at my pain, da 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 Sis Blue did you worse than Krishan Rock ever did you, love. It's time for you to face the reality today, all right? And you treat him like a king on a pedestal, all right? You treat him like he is your idol. Then now children are involved. And I don't get how people say Jaden's parenting is better when we have seen her hitting glass, tearing a blues house in shambles in front of minor children, allegedly. There's video footage. I'm just going to say allegedly, you know. The little boy came on social media saying he's afraid of Jaden and of what Jaden was going to do to him and that Jaden was going to hurt him, okay? This is what was on the Instagram video. Now, it's been a lot of foolishness in these back and forth uh, tweets that they're doing, you guys. I really don't understand it, but y'all know what it is. Y'all know I'm going to come up here and give y'all the latest, okay? And also, I will be playing some audio as well, but I kind of want to get into this... Um, these tweets so y'all can kind of understand what's going on okay so jade and alexis says sorry i'm late to the party i was getting my hair and makeup done me in daddy's video shoot today post op dropping soon then she says my baby daddy would have never not showed up on me and mine's dead homies then she says never once has my baby daddy ever, baby daddy ever said he would try to take my kids why because he never thought i was able to be sane to raise them so what does that say about this dumb broad y'all gonna have to excuse me y'all know these people don't use no periods no exclamation marks nothing and they have the time they were misspelled so y'all gonna have to bear with me okay so anyway she says if i made a bitch money i would care what she doing too dead homies the fuck that mean child then she said respectfully or disrespectfully leave my kids out of ish i ain't mad about none bitches tried to laugh at my pain now same one sitting looking stupid and yet i haven't said none nothing it's harder than it look huh imagine being number one anyway stream me and daddy music thanks for the theatrics for today she says um someone told her please come to baltimore and then she said why would i she also stated, Jade and Alexis also stated, but the Lord is faithful and he will strengthen you and protect you from the evil one. Ben tatted that. Today finna be so fun. Bye, Twitter friends. So um, she also says, I recall when I was in a hospital with Journey, I told him since it might be a day or two before she comes because I was induced medically due to health that if he wanted to go home and chill and uh, and i update him he could but he did and i appreciate him holding my leg thanks baby daddy it was it was great birth i'm look like i said i'm trying to read as best as i can child then she says um what else is this i think i okay i read that so y'all it's just a lot of shenanigans and back and forth so then carlissa says y'all can be mad and we're gonna listen to some audio with carlissa and as well as Blueface. but let's let's go ahead and read this she said y'all can be mad but you better scratch your a and be glad go back and tell that devil he is a lie and that javon will be raised with his father and no devil in hell will stop him okay she also says all john and andre ever wanted was their fathers to teach them to be men it's hard for a father to be a father in two houses at one time ladies listen when i talk because although i may make jokes it's because i laugh to keep from crying she says also um i hope y'all young ladies are learning the damage you will do to your own children by trying to compete with an already made family your child deserves for you to make the right choices and bringing them here a man can't be in two houses at one time elf responsibility then she continues to say don't come over here with that bs i told that girl to get all the way away from my family a year ago and y'all told her to stay uh to stay get the elf off my page with the bs okay then she posted a video with Krishan rock when she was on Krishan malone's uh jr's page and carlissa said this this is crazy rock you get you got to relax you cared nothing about his kids when you dragged about when you bragged excuse me about removing javon from his room and his home i understand you are angry but this is evil let me stop it there nobody removed javon but Blueface, because Blueface is the one that kicked him out let me continue now she says you said it yourself that john is a great father otherwise why let a poor father get you pregnant 99 times i know you're hurting i tried to save you from this please stop so that y'all can 
co-parent responsibly. Stop the vengeance before your fans start to see through through this. You're going to need these fans to help you comfortably raise your children without getting a job like me. Callie and Jaden had to. John didn't give us the luxury that you are getting for yours, so be grateful and happy for your bundle of joy. Everything is going to work out for all those who truly love the Lord. First of all, John ain't give Krishan nothing anyway. John, whoever his name is, Beluga, whatever y'all call the boy, he ain't give nobody nothing, okay? He was up there balling off of Krishan money, taking care of his other family over there. But child, that's not here or there. Let's get into this audio, honey, okay? Listen, I'll be up all night thinking about this world and shit. This bitch is a bipolar, schizophrenic ass, wishy washy ass. I want you there, but I don't want you to. I love you, but I hate you. I want to kill you, but I'm going to die for you. You're the worst, but you're the best. Like, bitch, pick one. Just pick one. My name is on the line, y'all. What the fuck is you going to tell me about defending myself all night? Bitch. I got a fucking kid with a fucking weirdo. You don't think I'm stressed out? So y'all gonna hear about it. Dead on me, so I'm gonna fuck what you think. You gonna hear me, bitch. Screw that crib. Oh, blue, be quiet. Go to bed. Stop talking, bitch. Fuck you. I can't go to bed. This shit, 18 years round. Dead on me. Nah, you need to go to bed, my nigga. Anyway, so you know, when let's get back to the tweets and then we're gonna play this second audio. Okay. Now, one of the tweets that stuck out to me was when Jade and Alexis said, If I made a bitch money, I would care what she's doing too. And this is my thing, y'all. See, sis, that's the problem. Okay, that's the problem right there. But if you have to tell yourself that lot to make yourself feel better, then go ahead. But him talking about rock 24-7 is very disrespectful to you, and you do not deserve that. Because he doesn't do Krishan like that. Him and Krishan have their problems. They may fight, pull each other hair out, teeth might go missing, whatever. All right, but he don't do that when I when he be on camera and all that with Krishan, okay? So it's a he know who to play, he know how far to go with Krishan, and he know how to how far to go with you. Okay, so you nor Rock have a prize, and there definitely is no winner in this situation, okay? You keep bringing up how Rock laughed at your pain. Well, didn't you laugh at hers? Okay. You said she talked about your kids. Well, you talked about hers, okay? So in my eyes, both of y'all wrong. Jada says she's number one, but but was yelling at him last night about um lying where he was at. Um, so your number one holds no weight. Now, if y'all didn't hear that footage of them getting into it, the argument, y'all go check out my previous um video and it will have that whole clip on there. Then y'all call this man daddy, okay? Where are y'all fathers, okay? See, that's the problem, because we know Krishan, about Krishan Rock's daddy, okay? So they told Jaden in her comments to come to Baltimore, and then she responded, why would I? Okay, but my question is, why would you not go to Baltimore, okay? Because you and Rock need to go ahead and catch y'all around and move along, because, baby, y'all always talking about each other, all 24-7. Y'all already sleeping together because y'all sleeping with the same man. Y'all both been pregnant. So obviously, no condoms or nothing has been used. And then on top of that, Jaden Alexis was already getting on his ass the other night. Well, last night, because she was like, yeah, you're not saying where you're going. And okay, go ahead and do what you want to do, because I'm about to go. I'm about to get a babysitter. I'm about to leave, too. Girl, you don't have to do all that. If you got to do all that, get out of the confines of your home in the middle of the night with your two children and get out of your bed to do what a nigga do or to prove a point to a nigga, you don't need that nigga because you are a mother. You need to be in that house with your kids, making sure your kids are good and not having some babysitter over there with your children chasing behind their daddy, okay? Or whatever he is. No, we that I'm not. Look, we don't sit on high horses over here. But right is right and wrong is wrong. Smart is smart and stupid is stupid. Okay. Now about the audio, y'all know Carlissa had to put her two two cents into the business, right? So let's go ahead and get into this little clip, y'all. When you had your journey, I gave you the same respect. I bent over. I kissed your ass. I did all of that for my babies. I got to do the same thing for this baby right here, and I'm going to need you to shut the fuck up talking about my baby. I'm going to need you to shut the fuck up and just love John and stay out of this because this is our family. Unfortunately, John put us in a situation that we all have to accept at this point. Just like your kid's my baby, her kid my baby too. Everybody shut the fuck up. Now, Jaden, when you had... I seen that video. Google it. Say blueface son exposed. 
Now, listen, y'all. Normally, I would sit up there and call Carlissa a wide back silverback gorilla or something like that, okay? Putting her two cents in the business. But, y'all, let me tell y'all something. I'm going to let Carlissa have this one because she made a little bit of a psychotic sense, honey. No shade. So, soon after that, Blue had to, of course, take advantage of the opportunity. And y'all know we had listened to that clip, y'all, of what he was just saying about Krishan Rock. Now, Blue, you're going to have to stop because you're going to drive yourself crazy, child, okay? Go on and see your baby you're focused more on her than your son okay so is she weird or are you the one that's weird okay and if you're mad you got her pregnant then why did you impregnate the girl a thousand times before this you didn't learn the 999 times before you didn't learn all those times before this, okay? Now, this is a hot mess of shitty shenanigans, okay? And none of y'all are going to learn. Not to be mean, but it's true, okay? This is just a hot mess. Y'all, tell me what y'all think, okay? Are they ops or are they really sister wives? Y'all swapping this, that, and the third. Y'all gotta let me know what's up with these girls because at this point, like I said, y'all might as well go ahead and do y'all poly show because, baby, y'all make more money doing it, okay? I'm just saying. All right, you guys, that's my time. Thank you guys for supporting this channel, and I will see you guys in the next one, girl.